Hey, welcome back to Shotoku Tech. So, I follow Lily Go, the TT Go folks, on Twitter, and they tweeted this here. A new random event, T-Watch Sim 868 version. If you like this post and retweet it, you have the opportunity to win this product. And my name got drawn, so that's pretty cool. And I just got it in the mail. Here's the product page on AliExpress. Again, it's the T-Watch 2019. It's got an SD card slot, and it also has GPS built in. And of course, it's got a slot for a SIM card, so you can access the cellular service on it. Here's the basic Arduino code for it, and you also need this GSM library. So we're gonna unbox this right now. Here we go. Okay, so here we go with the unbox. They got this cute little business card in here. Any question, feel free to contact us. And they've got email for business, sales, and technical. A couple of QR codes here. Takes you to the Lily Go website and takes you to the GitHub site. Kind of convenient. Clever box. Nice graphics. I like it. Simple. There's a little pamphlet that tells you about the features of the phone here. This has the USB Type C connector. TF card slot. It also has a I to C like Grove connector, just like the T-Watch 2019 does. Here's the assembly instructions there. Here's a diagram of the hardware that comes with it. Yeah, this includes GPS. So it's a GPS with the GSM cellular service. A couple of QR codes for documentation and libraries. I'm gonna flip this over the other way. Wow, it's getting even more detailed. Pay attention to the white line here. They're showing you how to add the expansion boards. Here's the expansion board layout and detailed pin diagram. So that's a pretty cool package. Thanks again, Lily Go, for uh, drawing my name out of the hat. Now here you go. This has these two antennas strapped onto the back and they're hinged. There's the power button, user button, the USB interface. There's the TF card slot. Oh, the SIM slot is exposed. So you don't need to open this up to add the SIM card. I think. Now, if, we're going to open it up anyway, probably. And then that's the Grove connector port. That's pretty cool. So you got a speaker, microphone, other. Let's take a look at some of the other features it says it has on here. Obviously, real time clock. It's got the power management and it's got motion. What? No, it doesn't have the LoRa. I have the LoRa backplanes. I'm waiting for another T-Watch 2019 to come in and I'm going to crack these open and add the LoRa backplanes to uh, the other TTGO T-Watches. Let's see what else we got in here. Here we got a short little uh, USB-C cable. That's kind of handy. Here's a watch band. I'm going to say I'm not wearing this on my wrist. Just don't know why, don't know why I would say that, but uh, this is going to be an interesting gadget. I'm interested in this gadget, but I see this gadget flying on a rocket more than anything else. What's in here? <laughs> Guess we'll find out. Hey, come on now, come on, come on. Where is it? Here it is. I'm just going to rip it open. Whoa. Oh, it's the board. This must be the standard backplane. Is that right? Yeah, because I can see the SIM card slot in here. So you can see the TF card slot, and there's the SIM card slot. So the 868, the SIM 868 board is in here, and this is the standard backplane for a TT Go T Watch. That's what I'm guessing, anyway. You get that little tiny cable adapter there. Yeah, see, so there's the Grove connector, TF card slot, and some other pinouts there. Don't know how that works. Yeah, I guess those would be exposed out that side port. So that must be the standard backplane. So if you wanted to go straight up. TT Go T Watch 2019. You could swap out the SIM 868 backplane with this standard backplane. Wow, that's interesting. I didn't realize they were going to pack that in there too. 
So that's pretty cool. I didn't know that. It comes with a little screwdriver so we can open it up. Guess should we open it up? Yeah, I think I want to open it up from the perspective of I want to see if I need to open it to put the SIM card in. So we're going to open it up here. This little screwdriver is cute. It's got a standard screwdriver on one end. It's got a Phillips on the other end. That's kind of cute. Looks like we've got some spare screws in the bag too. So I'm going to take this chain off. That makes it too difficult. Now all I want to do is take the back off and see how to access the SIM card. I got to order a SIM card for this. I'll just get a prepaid GSM. One more screw there. Okay, this should come off. There we go. Yeah, just there's the SIM card slot there. These little antenna wires are pretty stiff. Yeah, there's the SIM card slot. Looks like I would have to open this to insert the SIM. So there we have it. We'll uh, go ahead and cinch these back down again. And you want to make sure the wires go through the little slots there. The screw has to line up through the back plane and the case. There we go. Just need a little snap it together there a little bit. It even has a growth cable here if you need it. All right, so thanks again to the folks at LilyGo, and I'm looking forward to firing up this SIM 868 version of the TTGO T-Watch. And stay tuned. Thank you very much. Give this video a like. Click down below for the links in the description. Click up here to subscribe, and click over here to check out the TTGO playlist. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching Shotoku Tech. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share.